If you want to use Zoho Mail for sending your core opt-ins campaign from your Duplug.com account, then you have to connect your domain to your Zoho Mail. You have to verify your domain. So today's video, I will be showing you how you can connect and verify your Namecheap domain to your Zoho Mail. So I have signed into my Zoho Mail admin console and I have also signed into my Namecheap account. So after signing to your Zoho Mail admin console, click on add domains. And here it is. If you have any domain that's connected to your Zoho Mail account, then you can find them here. I'm going to add a new domain. Just click on add domain. You have to provide your domain here. So I'm going to collect the domain from my Namecheap account. This is the domain I will be connect. So I have based my domain name here. Click on add. And here it is. I have to verify my ownership. So this is the record. This is the record. I have to add my domain DNS as a TXT to verify the ownership of the domain. So I'm going, I'm going to copy the TXT record from my Zoho Mail admin console. Going to my Namecheap account. Click on manage. Click on advanced DNS. And here it is. I'm going to add the record as a TXT. Click on add new record. Find TXT. Under the host, it will be at and under the value, I'm going to paste the value that I have copied from my Zoho Mail admin console. This is the record. Just click on save, save all changes. And here it is. It's done. Now you have to wait a little bit. It could take 30, 30 minutes to one day to verify your actually ownership. So I'm going to wait a little bit. And after that, I will click on verify TXT record. Now I'm going to click on verify TXT record. Are you going to see is it connected or not? Yes, it's done. My domain is connected to my Zoho Mail account. So this is the very simple way you can connect your domain to your Zoho Mail account. And this is all for today. Thank you for watching.